Mr. President, my dear friend, Excellency Pranab Mukherjee, Governor Punjab, Honorable Shivraj Patel, Chief Minister, Honorable Sadar Prakash Singh Badal, Chancellor of this lovely university, Ashok Kumar Mittal, faculty members, professors, lecturers, most important of all, dear students. Namaskar and Sastriya Kaal. It is amazing by all standards to have made a university of this academic excellence and of the grandeur and size of the one in which today I had the honor of receiving an honorary doctorate degree. I am truly humbled by this very kind gesture by a university that grew to be the biggest university in India in about a decade or less than that. Today, this university has more than 30,000 students and of a high educational standard. As I was accompanied by the Chancellor of the University, Mr. Mittal, I told him of the need for education in Afghanistan, in particular for higher education. And he was very kind to offer that this university, the lovely professional university, would take as many Afghan students as we send on Afghan scholarships here. So I'm very grateful and thankful to the Chancellor for being so kind to Afghanistan. I know that there are some of Afghan students studying here already. But Mr. President, honorable dignitaries, ladies and gentlemen, students, India, as a friend of Afghanistan, has already contributed immensely to the upliftment of Afghan youth in education and higher studies. India today offers Afghan youth over 2,000 scholarships annually for studies in India. And the whole of India, you have now presence of Afghan students who are learning for a better future for Afghanistan. India has not only done that, India has gone beyond its means to contribute over $2 billion of its taxpayers' money of the hard toiling people of India to the betterment of Afghanistan, for which I bring you all the greetings and gratitude of the people of Afghanistan. Dear students, you, as citizens of India and as citizens of this region and as citizens of the world, are representing a country that is fast rising to the highest occasions of industrial and technological and economic growth. Your presence as a nation in terms of the good that you produce for the world is felt all around. While India is on this great path to progress and prosperity, 
remember fellow students that you also are coming from the background of one of the greatest civilizations on earth remember to take your culture your humanitarian values with you while you take further strides in your industrial and technological advancement and make sure that your force that the power the energy that you generate is a cause for good in india and also beyond that india is seen as a country with the great powers of technology and sciences but also a country that remains faithful to the origin goodness of mankind the human being as he or she is that message i would convey to the rest of the youth in india through this university time is short because i was late <laughs> i was late because my plane broke down thankfully on the ground <laughs> and then we had to replace it and that caused a delay of two hours i apologize for that to the president of india to the government of punjab to this lovely university and to you all the students and i'm greatly humbled and honored to be in front of you today and to have been conferred upon this honorary degree which i hope i will deserve and work for to deserve thank you very much